it's time for the main. Helen reheats her chicken curry and knocks up some coconut rice. You might just add a little bit more coconut. Yeah, go coconuts! Finally, it's good to go. Time to spice up the night. And there it is, Massaman chicken curry with coconut rice. I really like it. Um, I knew it wouldn't be big on heat, um, so mm. and which I'm actually quite enjoying. I quite like the fact that it's quite floral and it's a dainty curry. Yeah, I just I just think it lacked a bit of flavour, to be honest. I was just missing something. Can I ask you, mm -hmm. did you marinate your chicken and did you seal it? I didn't, no. I like chicken when it's marinated and sealed and then the sauce is made. And it's like, it's, it, it, for me, it, it was like, it was just a bit too sort of stodgy and, and soaked, like boiled sort of thing. Are you enjoying it? Yeah. Really? The main was bland. The rice was hard. Um, the potatoes were hard as well. The chicken, there was no flavour in that chicken whatsoever. Oh, dear. Come on, someone, lighten the mood. I, I like to think of myself as quite handy with the old chopsticks. OK. Not mentioned it yet, but, uh, yeah, it was can in Asia. Can you show me how you pick up the rice? I can pick up one single grain. Are you ready? Well done, Dean. And that's how I eat, by the way. Really? Just, just, it's just gonna one. It's going to take you all night. We're going to be here till midnight, Dean. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I don't want to overload myself with carbs, but um, watching, yeah. watching the way. Especially what we're doing later. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Boring you, are we, Felicia? Can I just ask one thing? Can you come off your phone, please? <laughs> <laughs> because this... Come on. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so sorry. I know, it's a little bit rude. I, I thought nobody gone. would have noticed, and I, know, I was just, like, quiet. I would like, never quiet. start texting at someone's dinner party. I think that's really rude. And, you know... Put a lot of effort yeah. in tonight. I should have directed some conversation to me, then, then maybe I should would have, you know, not been I did direct a conversation at you. All right, guys. <laughs> Sisters? I wasn't particularly impressed with the fact that Felicia was on her phone. Um, it's not something that I would expect. It's literally just the phone. So if that spoilt her evening, <laughs> which I hope it hasn't, then, you know, would I, can I, should I say I'm sorry? No, I'm not going to. How about some first impressions? That always calms things down. B, immediately I thought you were a lovable entertainer. Felicia, I looked at you and saw this glamorous, feisty, driven woman. You are a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't named her. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I feel like we've really gotten on. And Helen, I think you are this shining light and um, quite wisdomous, if that is a word. <laughs> it isn't. Um, and, uh, yeah, I've really enjoyed getting to know you. We're like a family. You two are my brothers, so you're my younger brother, the cheeky one that I think is so annoying. You're my older brother, the one that's wise, but I still find you annoying. <laughs> you're my big uncle. Uncle. Your Uncle B. Uncle, uncle B. B for life. And Helen's like my distant cousin, the cousin that, like, like when, I, when I'm with her, I'm like, yay! And then, like, after, I'm like, bye. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's been proper good vibes. Um, yeah, like, it's been nice. OK. So Felicia said about the distant cousin, and then I looked over at Helen, and Helen was furious. And I felt really bad for her. Am I meant to lie and be like, oh, I love you forever on end? No, I'm a human being, and you're also a human being, and sometimes you annoy me, and sometimes I annoy you. Oh, I'm going to go to the toilet. <laughs> Yeah, I think some of Felicia's comments might have got under Helen's skin a little bit. Um, that sort of thing hasn't happened the entire week, and so I thought we might have got away with it. Well, I, I, I sat there and I was just like, I don't, I don't know what's going on, and I was a little bit upset, really. Well, this is awkward. Lovely wine. Isn't it? Well done, B. I respect her opinion. It's fine. We're not all going to gel. And, you know, I've made enough friends in my life to know who I want in my life and who I don't. <laughs>